Hey friends, welcome back. And if you're new to my channel, I welcome you. I have a Bath & Body Works candle review of their new three wick candle. It's their uh, spring candle in the scent Positively Sweet and it's the Dark Chocolate Truffles. And I'm gonna zoom in a little bit closer to show you this gorgeous jar design. I really do like this. So the scent notes for this candle is rich chocolate, gooey butterscotch, candied cherry. And first off, I love the aesthetics of the candle just as it's lit. It's such a beautiful candle and Bath & Body Works currently has like a floral candle holder that I've been eyeing. It's super fancy. It appears to be gold colored, but if you know what I mean, they have this new candle holder out that this candle just looks amazing inside that floral type design candle holder. So I'm definitely eyeing that to um, display this beautiful collection. So I want to show you the actual wax and wicks. So I've been having this candle going for about an hour and a half now. Um, it's taken a little bit of time to melt out. It's melting out a little bit weird, but um, I've been getting a really nice throw. The throw, in my opinion, is about a good eight. Um, it's not a super powerhouse thrower, like a 10, but it's it'll be great in like a medium space. And I think it may be a bit too much in a small space room, but medium to large space, this candle would be perfect, I believe. The aroma is just delicious. I get the rich chocolate, which smells more like a milk chocolate to me. Um, I don't get any kind of um, pungent, tangy, dark chocolate note. Um, you know how dark chocolate, well, the better word to use would be bitter. Um, I don't get a bitterness from the chocolate. I do get like a rich milk chocolate, even though it says this is a dark chocolate truffles. Um, I really do enjoy this scent. Even on cold, I could detect the cherry note there. And it does smell like chocolate covered cherries, honestly. Um, this one throws really good. The aroma smells fantastic. To me, this is a mood setting candle with the chocolate and the cherry. I don't get too much butterscotch, which I'm really happy about because butterscotch can be a bit too cloying in my opinion. I'm just not a huge fan of butterscotch scented candles, but I don't think this candle necessarily needed to have a strong butterscotch note. I'm so happy it doesn't. I get mostly milk chocolate and candied cherries. It almost smells like um, cherry cordials. So this candle smells fantastic, you guys. Definitely hoard worthy in my opinion. I will be backing this one up. I picked up, I believe, three or four of these. So I will be picking up more, definitely. Um, I don't have anything in my collection like this other than the cherry mocha candle that came out, I want to say over three years ago. I still have one or two in my collection um, that I would love to pull out and compare it to, but this one is definitely more heavier on the chocolate. You do get the cherry in the background, which it, it doesn't smell like a fake cherry smell, but um, I'm really enjoying this candle. It's really nice. I've had no issues with the wicks at all. Um, not too bad on the mushrooming. Um, just be mindful to trim your wicks in between burns. But other than that, this candle smells scrumptious and I think it's perfect addition um, to Valentine's Day. Definitely mood setting. It's a sexy scent. It's gourmand and um, it's really yummy. It's gonna make you wanna eat and crave chocolate. So um, I really hope you guys enjoyed this candle review. Leave me some comments down below. Are you guys eyeing the positively sweet dark chocolate truffles three wick candle? Is this something that you would like to try? I highly recommend it because it's been a while since we've had such a good chocolate gourmand candle. Um, I know we always have um, the hot cocoa and cream. This is nothing like that. I don't detect like a cocoa note. I detect like rich chocolates. Like 
your Godiva chocolates, which I am a huge fan of when I can get by a store. But um, yeah, this one smells fantastic, you guys, and definitely hoard worthy in my opinion. So leave me some comments down below. And if you enjoyed this video, be sure to subscribe and also thumbs up. And I'll talk to you all in my next video. Bye.